Hello class, Mr. Wilson here, and I'm gonna go over what we're doing today. Um, so I got, I got something fun for you guys, um, and <clears throat> that also goes with our coding. Um, I should be back soon, so I miss you guys, and I uh, can't wait to see you guys when I return. Alrighty. So, we're gonna be doing Minecraft Hour of Code. If you've done this before, that's awesome. If not, um, we're basically going to be putting some code together and trying to complete the objectives. So 1 to 14, you should be able to finish all 14 today. Okay, so let's go over the first, I'll, let's say the first three I'll do with you. Alrighty, so we've got move forward, turn left, turn right. Now if you notice, if we, if we move these, let's say we do all three of them. Okay, so if we run it, He's gonna move forward, he's gonna turn left, he's gonna turn right. And then he's, so we, we weren't able to get uh, to the sheep. So we're supposed to be walking to the sheep. So what I'm gonna do is, so in order to get to the sheep, we need to move once, twice. So we're gonna move forward twice. Now let's see if what happens if we move forward three times. Does it do anything? Oh, so we push the sheep away. So we need to take one away. So that's good information to know, just for next. All right, so number two. All right, wood is a very important resource. Many things are made from it. Walk to the trees and use it. Use destroy, use the destroy block command to chop it down. So are we facing towards it? Looks like, so we need to move once, twice. Now, if we move forward, let's see where it takes us. Does, do we go straight? Yeah, we do, okay. All right, so we're gonna move forward once, twice, and then we're going to destroy block. All righty, we got some wood. Coo, coo, coo. I don't, I don't know about you guys, but I, I, I love this kind of stuff. All right, sheep shearing time. Use the shear command to gather wood from both sheep. So make sure you're reading the directions. This will give you an idea of what we're supposed to be doing. All right, because we always want to get that end goal. So we're going to have to walk here, shear this sheep, turn to the right, walk walk here, and then shear this sheep. So move forward twice, then shear, okay? Then we're going to turn to the right. Looks like we can also change this direction left to right. Cool. We're going to turn to the right and then move forward and then shear that sheep. Cool. Alrighty. Now something's cool something cool is here, let's go back. Let's go back to number three. So if we look at our code, look it says show code. So this is the code that we did. So this the language is JavaScript, so good to know. Let's go tell the computer what to display on the screen. Everything you see and do in Minecraft also starts with the lines of code look like. So move forward. So interesting that, that the commands, looks like this is indicating that it's a command. Very interesting. Alrighty. So we need to build a house before the sun goes down. Houses require a lot of wood. Cut down all three trees. So we are going to move forward, move forward, move forward. Destroy block, turn left, move forward. So one, two, three, destroy, turn the left. So then we're gonna have to do one, two, three again. Destroy block. And then turn to the left again and then move one, two, three, and destroy block. Okay, let's run it. Now, if you notice, these are all so move forward, move forward, move forward, destroy. Turn left. 
So these are all the same thing, okay? So it's three move forwards, destroy, and turn left. Three move forwards, destroy, and turn left. So well, I think the next one is going to be where we're creating a loop. So if we create a loop where we start back at the top, super cool. And then always make sure that you're watching the videos. Does it give us a video? I think it did, but I, I skipped over it. <laughs> okay, every house starts with a wall. Build a wall. Build the first part of your house by putting the place and move forward commands inside the repeat button. Oh, okay. Okay. So first thing we're gonna do, we are going to place. Now we're gonna move forward. Run it four times. So one, two, three, four. Cool. Choose the floor panel for your house. So you can do easy, medium, or hard. And then it'll give you what to do. Alrighty. So, you know, try to at least get to number 10. I would say, you know, use this time and, uh, you know, you guys can work together, ask, ask each other for some help and, you know, have fun with it. Alrighty, I'll see you later.